That was a guy playing violin. It's the end of the bar mitzvah, bat mitzvah ceremony. People on the trip who haven't ever been bar bat mitzvahed just gave little speeches uh, about, uh, and then they were bar bat mitzvahed, and the speeches were very moving, uh, unbelievably so. I mean, there was, um, you know, the, the first girl spoke about the three boys who were killed. Uh, by terrorists this month and, and how much that affected her and she was crying and uh, there was a lot of crying. Another girl is, is from Asia and, and is finally connected with her roots. Uh, there were two girls that talked about the fathers they've lost. One of them lost her father just uh, five weeks ago and he bought her this plane ticket and in a way he knew that she would need the strength of this trip to help her get through that. And another girl lost her father when she was 12. and. Uh, she thinks about him every day, and uh, it was just very moving. I was crying, and uh, it's just a beautiful experience. To you know, we're, we're connecting with, with Judaism here. Uh, people are really finding themselves and their roots and their soul here, and uh, it's a great. Well, it's not quite the end of the trip, but it's a, a nice cap to what's been an amazing time so far. Normally, I would give a funny punchline at the end of my videos because. You know, I'm kind of a comedian type, but uh, I think we will just leave this, leave this as a, as a, as a moving experience. Uh, well, there's the gang. So I'll go back and join the bar and bat mitzvah. I think they're going to be lifting the chair up now. And uh, I'm not sure what the Israeli healthcare system is like, but I hope it's good because it sounds like a dangerous uh, situation. What's in the cup? Is it water or is it wine? When you have